Hello, fellow explorers. Welcome to Julie's channel. Alright guys, buckle up, because today's news is gonna stir up some serious thoughts, especially if you've been keeping up with the Duggar family saga. Jana Duggar just got married. Yep, the eldest Duggar daughter, who's been the center of so many fan discussions for years, is now officially off the market. And oh boy, the details of her wedding? They're juicy, so let's dive straight in. First up. Jana Duggar. 34, married. Stephen Wisman. 31, in a surprise wedding. Now, this is the part where fans' jaws hit the floor, because Jana has been notoriously single for so long. People have speculated. Why? She hasn't tied the knot, and some even theorized she was happy living a more independent life compared to her siblings. But BAM, she surprises everyone by marrying Stephen in what feels like a blink of an eye. No public courtship announcements, no televised engagement, just a quiet ceremony. It's almost like she wanted to say, hey, you don't know. Everything. About my life. Well played, Jana. Well played. But let's talk about. Who was there? Of course, a Duggar wedding isn't complete without an army of family members, and from what we know. Many. Of her siblings showed up. And guess who made a rare appearance? Justin Duggar. Yeah, you remember Justin, right? He's been laying pretty low since stepping out of the spotlight a few years ago, but he showed up at Jana's wedding with his wife Claire. And let's be real, fans were all over this. Justin's been avoiding the limelight ever since the whole Josh Duggar scandal. And seeing him at the wedding is a big deal. Why? Because a lot of the family members haven't exactly been publicly supportive of Josh after his conviction. In case you forgot, though, how could you? Josh Duggar was sentenced in 2021 for downloading and possessing child sex abuse images. It was a dark time for the family, and it felt like everyone had to pick a side. But Justin? He showed up at Josh's trial, sitting with Josh's wife. Anna. And even being by Josh's side throughout some of the proceedings. That right there says a lot about family dynamics. Some of the Duggars completely stayed away from Josh during the trial, but Justin clearly wasn't one of them. Now, people have been speculating. Why? He's distanced himself from social media and public life, and whether that has anything to do with the tensions surrounding Josh's legal battles. But seeing him at Jana's wedding, looking all dapper in his suit, with his wife Claire in a vibrant green dress, it was one of those moments where you're like, ah, there's Justin. So, he's still around. Moving on to the other guests. Jeremy Vuolo. You know, the husband of Ginger Duggar. Posted a slideshow of photos from the wedding on Instagram, and one of those pictures had him sitting next to Justin and Claire. The picture-perfect moment, right? It's interesting to see how Jeremy, who's also distanced himself from the ultra-conservative Duggar lifestyle, is still involved in these family events. What makes this wedding even more intriguing is that fans have been waiting for years for Jana to get married, especially with how fast-paced her siblings' love lives have been. The Duggar family is known for getting married young and starting families practically immediately. But, Jana? She's taken her time, and honestly, that's pretty refreshing. We've seen her go through some intense fan scrutiny over the years, with endless rumors about her love life. Remember when people were convinced she was dating family friend? Lawson Bates. Or all those times the media wondered if she'd ever move out of her parents' house. This wedding is like the ultimate curveball for all those rumors. One thing that's noticeably absent from all this wedding news, though, is any mention of kids. Duggar weddings are usually followed by baby announcements so quickly that people barely have time to breathe between the I do and the we're expecting. But Justin and Claire? Nope. No pregnancy announcements from them yet. 
They've been married since February 2021, but no sign of a baby on the way, and that's got fans wondering. Are they intentionally slowing down? Are they choosing a different path from the Duggar norm? It's a huge contrast to the Duggar family ethos, where children seem to follow right after marriage, sometimes within months. Justin and Claire moved to Texas shortly after their wedding, away from the Duggars' family home in Arkansas, which in itself is a pretty big step. And it seems like they've been breaking away from Jim Bob's strict family rules, especially when it comes to marriage and starting a family right away. They're living in their own RV, doing a whole renovation project on it, and, from the looks of it, enjoying life. On their terms. Fans have definitely noticed this more laid-back approach to marriage and family, and it's left a lot of people asking, are we seeing a new trend among the younger Duggar kids? Could they be moving away from the quiverful mindset of having as many kids as possible? Now, if you're wondering about Jana and her future family plans, nothing's been confirmed yet, but there's a lot of speculation. Will she follow in the footsteps of her younger siblings and start a family right away? Or could she take a page from Justin's book and do things a little differently? And let's not forget the elephant in the room. Josh Duggars. Conviction. His trial and imprisonment have been hanging over the family like a dark cloud, and it's hard to ignore that a lot of Duggars have had to adjust how they navigate the public eye because of it. Justin was notably there for his brother during the trial, while many other siblings weren't. It's a divisive issue within the family, and the way it's impacted their public personas is something we'll be watching for a while. Josh is set to be released in 2032. But until then, the Duggar family is going to have to continue navigating this tricky, scandal-ridden landscape. Every public appearance, every family gathering, and every wedding, like Jana's, has this underlying tension because of it. Will it continue to create fractures in the family? Only time will tell. So, there you have it, Jana Duggar finally tied the knot, Justin Duggar made a rare appearance, and the Duggar family drama just keeps getting more layered. What do you think about Jana's decision to keep her wedding under wraps? And do you think Justin and Claire are setting a new trend for the younger Duggars to follow? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. And hey, if you want more updates on your favorite reality TV families or the latest celebrity gossip, hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for the next video. Alright, that's it for today's deep dive. See you in the next one, guys. This content may violate our usage policies. Did we get it wrong? Please tell us by giving this response a thumbs down 